Hello and welcome back to the sideboard one last time here at StarCityGames.com Open Series in Cincinnati. I'm here with our legacy Open champion, Para Nystrom. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Oh, we'll do this. Yeah. <laughs> Excellent. You of course, you're of course from Sweden, but you're mm -hmm. studying right now in Toronto and you're kind of bouncing back and forth. You played in Detroit, yep. played here, took down the legacy Open with death and taxes. Why, how'd you come to that conclusion? Uh, well, the thing was, when I moved to Toronto in January, I knew I was going to buy a deck. Mm -hmm. uh, first time I really owned my own Legacy deck. And it just happened to be Death and Taxes. Don't really know why. Um, yeah. Just no preference? Just Well, of course, there's a certain preference, I guess. Um, I like small creatures. <laughs> I do not like to play, play like control. Mm -hmm. Well, you could all, you can make the, Dan the Danes make arguments that this is actually a control deck, but yeah, no. It's definitely very taxing, and you yeah. played the deck very well today. You were on camera against Greg Smith, your only loss, but a very good match. I think a lot of people will rewatch that one. A good match, though. And, and it was, uh, I may have thrown it away, but a good match. Yeah. What was your toughest matchups today? Uh, I played two Elves deck. Two Elves? Yeah. Um, in the quarterfinals against Elves, and yeah, some, sometime during the Swiss. And I got really lucky both times. Your GTA did a lot of work. <laughs> In Indeed. the quarterfinals, for sure. Is that yeah. how you got through it in the Swiss as well? No, he just took a couple of mulligans. Oh, okay. That'll help. Yeah, I mean, the game one in the quarterfinals was over within <laughs> about three turns when he just comboed you off. But then yeah. games two and three, GT did, a, did yeah. all the work. And, uh, you know, semifinals and finals, you played Rug Delver. Mm -hmm. How's that matchup usually work? And I don't how'd know. How'd you navigate it so well? Uh, well, I don't know. Since I, I got the deck and then I would have played this tournament, Detroit, and an FNM or something at home. So three or four tournaments with the deck, I'm not really well practiced. I don't know what the matchup. It feels very, very rough when they go on the play and just tempo you out with creatures and they yeah. and on, on the play, you can make it. Of course, most matchups against Rugged Over on the play are pretty <laughs> difficult, yeah. I would say. But Seeing them well the deck. Yeah. Now, of course, uh, you, you told me you, you had a 12th place finish at Pro Tour Hawaii uh, in 2009. Yeah, right? five years ago. So you're definitely someone that is known on the Pro Tour scene. You know, and of course on the Open Series, you now have a, have a trophy, so that's pretty <laughs> I know, a trophy, yes. So. Do you plan on trying to make it to the Invitationals? I have no idea. I'm going back to Sweden in two weeks, and then, well, if I can find, find someone to travel with, I may be going back before the years to an end. Well, your qualification is good for a pretty, <laughs> pretty good while, so we yeah. hope to see you back. So uh, congratulations again. Thank you very much. For Para, I am Nick Miller here on the sideboard. Going to send it back to the booth for one last time.